Hi there, Arnabees. Crochet B here with my first edition of Crochet B's Happy Mail. So unlike Sandy, I don't get Happy Mail like every other day. This is my first Happy Mail. So I wanted to make sure that I got my money's worth. So I got a big Happy Mail. So I'm going to show you what I got. It's a, it's a ginormous box. Okay, that's just the padding, right? Okay, oh, here it is. Well, maybe we should just cut the bottom and then just no. pull it out. <laughs> We're going to have to tip it. Really? Yeah. It's got stuff on it. What the hell? It's just the stuffing. Okay, so. <laughs> that's what I was saying. We could cut the bottom. And now we're going to do that. All right. So this is something that I've been waiting for, for about four weeks, and it is... Very heavy. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Oh, there we go. That's my fingers. Ouch, that's my fingers. <sighs> it's my brand new... Monsoon. So this is my new carpet cleaning machine. Yay! Yay! And basically, um, this was custom built for me. I thought when I ordered it, there was going to be a whole um, factory full of them and they would just throw this on a truck. But no, when you order it, they actually custom build it for you. So this is like a Rolls Royce. They make them one at a time. So basically, the main reason I got this machine, it's only been on the market for about one month and it's claim to fame over the other equipment that I have because even though I'm only one person, I already have three other machines. I have two ninjas and my big warrior that I use for the commercial jobs, but this job has the most powerful vacuum motors in the entire carpet cleaning industry. So one of the problems that I've been running into is um, people want the carpets dry as quickly as possible. There's only so much that you can do. You give them instructions on open the windows, uh, turn up the heat, get some fan going. People don't always listen and they get upset when it takes uh, more than six hours for the carpet to dry. So this machine actually has vacuum motors that are four times more powerful than my most powerful machine. So this will hopefully help to alleviate that problem. So this is my happy mail for today. It's not yarn. What? Okay. It's not exciting, but I'm pretty excited. And so what I'd like you all to do is look at this beautiful red machine and maybe help me come up with a name for this. Um, so if you want to leave that in the comments, what should I name this beautiful machine that I have that's so new that it still has the tag on it? Okay. Thanks, Yarnabee. See you next time. Bye.